Good morning. Today's devotion is brought to you by the people of Gulland United Methodist Church. My name is Young Hwan Won. I'm a pastor here in the Gulland United Methodist Church. We gather for worship service on Sundays at 10.30 in the morning, Mountain Time, and we exist as a church to help people to be connected with God and with one another. We'd like to invite you into our worship either in person or online through our Facebook page. We'd like to learn your name and get to know you. I am sharing devotion in the morning, Monday through Friday. I hope this is a reminder for you that the message of God is with you not only at the church on Sundays, but also with you in your life situations throughout the week. Lent season this year just has begun with Ash Wednesday and first Sunday in Lent just this last week. Our journey, spiritual journey, began. In this journey, we are reminded of Jesus' love and grace and especially His sacrificial love on the cross for us. We were once sinners, but His grace is bigger than our sin and weaknesses. Therefore, we are able to live today as a new creation, as a, with a new identity as His children. During the six weeks Lenten journey, let us focus on how we got recovered from our sin and reconciled our relationship with God. There are many things we can meditate on during Lenten season. How about the image of God in us? God created each of us in His image. We can also think about human sin and weakness. We know the story that Adam and Eve committed a sin before God in the Garden of Eden. Likewise, we can think about human sin and weakness. And there are more to consider as food for thought and our spirit. Topics like human limitation, Jesus' incarnation, Jesus' crucifixion, and his saving grace for us. Lent season this year, we invite us into meditation on the creation work of God, salvation work, and continuing guidance of God for us today. So this Lent season, let us think about many topics about God and let us grow spiritually day by day uh, for those Lent uh, period. Today's devotion is from the Gulland United Methodist Church. Good morning. Today's devotion is brought to you by the people of Gulland United Methodist Church. My name is Young Hwan Won. I'm a pastor here in the Gulland United Methodist Church. We gather for worship service on Sundays at 10.30 in the morning, Mountain Time, and we exist as a church to help people to be connected with God and with one another. We'd like to invite you into our worship either in person or online through our Facebook page. We'd like to learn your name and get to know you. I am sharing devotion in the morning, Monday through Friday. I hope this is a reminder for you that the message of God is with you not only at the church on Sundays, but also with you in your life situations throughout the week. Do you have family members, your parents, children, cousins, and many other family members? When you see uh, your children, grandchildren, or parents, you may find your, your images through each other. Your family members have your image in them, and you have their images in you as well. It's an amazing thing. The creation work of God is just amazing and wonderful like this. We consider ourselves as the children of God. Therefore, you also have God's image in you. This is not just a feeling or assumption, but it is true, no matter what, that each of you has the image of God in you. There is even biblical foundation that you have the image of God. The book of Genesis says, Then God said, Let us make a humankind in our image, according to our likeness. It also says, God created humankind in His image. In the image of God, He created them. The Bible witnesses that you are created in the image of God. Therefore, each of you is so special. You are the one who has God's image in you. So please remember that and let us live our lives as the children of God. We have God's image in us, and it is a great gift. Today's devotion is from the Gulland United Methodist Church. 
Good morning. Today's devotion is brought to you by the people of Gulland United Methodist Church. My name is Yang Hwan Won. I'm a pastor here in the Gulland United Methodist Church. We gather for worship service on Sundays at 10.30 in the morning, mountain time, and we exist as a church to help people to be connected with God and with one another. We would like to invite you into our worship either in person or online through our Facebook page. We would like to learn your name and get to know you. I am sharing devotion in the morning, Monday through Friday. I hope this is a reminder for you that the message of God is with you not only at the church on Sundays, but also with you in your life situations throughout the week. Yesterday, we thought about the image of God in us. I shared with you that each of you has God's image in you. Therefore, we should discover image of God in us and in others. Then do you discover the image of God in your neighbors, family, and friends? Whenever you meet them and have a relationship with them, please don't forget they are created in the image of God. Your family, friends, and neighbors are special because they have the image of God in them. It's a great thing that you can interact with people who have the image of God. Therefore, whenever we meet with others, let us respect them and love them. They have God's image in them. They are God's children. Also, don't forget about yourself. You have the image of God in you, of course. Be confident and joyful. Also, show the image of God you have to others. You have a reason to be confident you are created in the image of God. Let us help others to see the image of God through us in our daily living. And let us help others to discover the image of God they, that they already have in them as well. Today's devotion is from the Gulland United Methodist Church. Good morning. Today's devotion is brought to you by the people of Gulland United Methodist Church. My name is Yang Hwan Won. I'm a pastor here in the Gulland United Methodist Church. We gather for worship service on Sundays at 10.30 in the morning, mountain time, and we exist as a church to help people to be connected with God and with one another. We would like to invite you into our worship either in person or online through our Facebook page. We would like to learn your name and get to know you. I am sharing devotion in the morning, Monday through Friday. I hope this is a reminder for you that the message of God is with you not only at the church on Sundays, but also with you in your life situations throughout the week. God has entrusted his creatures into, into the hands of humankind. The book of Genesis says, God blessed humankind and God said to them, be fruitful and multiply and fill the earth and subdue it and have dominion over every living thing upon the earth. Friends, this is your identity. You are created in the image of God and you have authority entrusted by God to take good care of his creatures here on earth. You have authority given by God. Of course, humans are not perfect. Humans committed a sin and turned away from God. We know that humans have a sinful nature in us. That's true. However, it doesn't change that we have the divine image in us. We have a sinful nature in us, but it doesn't. It cannot remove the image of God in us. Therefore, with confidence, I am telling you, let us remember our identity as the image of God and the children of God. You are the one to whom God entrusted his creatures. Let us live today as the people of God in confidence in him. Today's devotion is from the Gulland United Methodist Church. Good morning. Today's devotion is brought to you by the people of Gulland United Methodist Church. My name is Yang Hwan Won. I'm a pastor here in the Gulland United Methodist Church. We gather for worship service on Sundays at 10.30 in the morning, mountain time, and we exist as a church to help people to be connected with God and with one another. We would like to invite you into our worship either in person or online through our Facebook page. We would like to learn your name and get to know you. 
I am sharing devotion in the morning, Monday through Friday. I hope this is a reminder for you that the message of God is with you not only at the church on Sundays, but also with you in your life situations throughout the week. We are the one who carry out the image of God. God and His holiness are revealed on earth, through us as well as in heaven. This week, let us take a moment to discover God's image in us. Try something for you to discover divine image in you. You may take a look at your face through the mirror and see if you have God's image in you. I literally mean it. Give it a try. How many times do you seriously take a look at your face, not just to check your outward appearance, but to check yourself inward? This weekend, give it a try, looking at your face, and see if you have God's image in you. You should find God's image through your face and through your heart. While you take a look at your face through the mirror, give thanks to God for amazing and wonderful creation work, which is you. You have the image of God rooted in yourselves. Please don't forget that. Today's devotion is from the Gulland United Methodist Church. <laughs> 